Good morning, everybody. It's January 10th, Sunday, 2016. I want to welcome you to Two Minutes with PJ. Uh, the message I have today is about uh, basically he gives us rest. Now, the person that he, that's God, that is the one that gives us rest. Now, we know that God rested. In Genesis 2, 2, And on the seventh day, God ended his work, which he had made. And he rested because of his work that he did. Now, if we know for six days, God worked on creation. And on that seventh day, he decided to rest and thought it was good. In Exodus, Moses was giving the commandments. And the third commandment is keep holy the Sabbath day. Exodus 28 through 10, 11. Remember the Sabbath day to keep it holy. Six days shall uh, labor and do all work. On the seventh day, it is the Sabbath, the day of the Lord of, the God, of thy God. And in it you shall not work, nor your son, nor your daughter, manservant, maidservant, your cattle, a stranger. For in six days the Lord made heaven and earth the sea and all of them, and then rested on the seventh day. So the Lord blessed the Sabbath day and made it holy. Isaiah 14, 3, And it shall come to pass in the day that the Lord shall give thee rest from sorrow, from fear, and hard bondage um, that you may serve. Jesus reinforced it in Matthew eleven twenty eight. Come unto me, all you that labor and have heavy laden, for I give you rest. So as God rested on that seventh day, we too need to rest on the seventh day and keep it holy. The seventh day is a Sabbath. This is the Lord's day. It was given to Moses as the third of the Ten Commandments when Moses was on Mount Sinai and the, the people the Israelites needed to keep it but had trouble keeping it Jesus when he was on earth he did miracles on the Sabbath and they that's part of the reason they wanted to kill him God gives us rest from sorrow fear and bondage God will heal us God will help us with our sorrows he will help us with our fears and hard bondage. Jesus promises to give us rest through him. He already did that through the cross. He gave us eternal rest. He, we shall not perish. We shall not be burdened when we are in our new bodies. Have a blessed Sunday. And remember, have a great day of rest. Keep holy the Sabbath, and God bless you all.